Hi, this is Stephanie Manley with Copycat.com. Today I want to show you how to make a classic dish. It's called funeral potatoes. And why do you call them funeral potatoes? Because this is often a dish that you bring to a meal after a funeral here in the South where I live. So today I wanted to show you how to make funeral potatoes. Now this looks kind of complicated, but I promise it's not. It's really, really easy to make. We're going to use a bag of hash brown potatoes. We're also going to use some sour cream, some butter, some chopped onion. We're going to use a can of cream of chicken soup. We're going to top it off with cheddar cheese and some cornflakes. And of course, we're always going to use a little bit of salt and pepper and some chopped onion. So these are really, really easy to make. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and empty our hash browns into a bowl here. So then we're going to stir in a stick of melted butter. That's a half a cup of melted butter. I just heated up this up in the microwave for about a minute. We're going to add 16 ounces of sour cream. Okay, and then we're going to add in a can of cream of chicken soup mix. Eventually it will come out of the can. <laughs> All right. Okay, now we're gonna stir these very carefully together. It's really important to use a bowl that's too small. That makes them taste extra good. So the next things we're gonna add is our chopped onions, our salt, and our pepper. Be sure to click on the link in the description box for the actual recipe. All right, so I'm gonna put a little bit of nonstick spray in a nine by 13 inch baking dish, and then I'm just gonna pour these out in here. I'm going to spread them out. I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of cheese on top. All right, this is probably the most controversial part of this recipe. It's actually, do you put cornflakes on top or not. I don't know, it's your call. But I personally like them. So you crush them up just a little bit, not a lot. About three handfuls will do. You're going to stir the cornflakes in the melted butter. This is what makes them nice and crispy. And then we're just going to top our casserole with them. Next thing we're gonna do is put this in the oven for about an hour and it'll be ready. Now at this point, you could actually just put foil on top of it and go ahead and make this up whenever you get ready to serve this. Again, it's gonna take about an hour to go ahead and cook it up. Or you can heat it up and eat it right away. So we've just made Funeral potatoes is, is a wonderful dish to make, and if you don't need a death in the family to have it, you can have it at any time. So please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe so you can see what's cooking next. 